How's it going everyone? Out here fishing the stock pond with Kyler. Just caught a nice little bluegill. We're going to be doing a catching cook because we're hungry. And we're going to try and catch trout. But for now we're going to put this on the strainer in case we can't catch any trout. But we'll try for trout and see what we can get. Oh, dude, there's a trout. There is? Yeah. Let me get the worm down there. That's a big bluegill. Oh, it's got a line coming out of its mouth. <laughs> you just did a lot of just caught this trout. Not very big, but it's got a line coming out of its mouth. It's got a hook down its throat. I think that's the one we're probably missing it. Alright, well, we're going to eat this sucker. Well, after a long time of missing fish, we finally did get one. Got it on this like brown cast master. But yeah, we, I probably missed about six fish on this and finally caught one. So things might be starting to turn around here. All right, well we moved spots because we weren't catching anything and we got hungry, so we're gonna cook these up. But what we did is we just, with the bluegills, we just, you know, cut their heads off, cut up the belly and just took all the scales off. With the trout, we did the same thing, but we left the scales on. And we got a few different seasonings here, like soul food, whatever that is, that seasoning. And then we got Cajun paprika. and paprika and, and lemon pepper. And we're just going to season them up with whatever seasonings we like and just cook them in some oil. All right, so we got it in here. It's it's cooking, kind of, and yeah, I mean, there's a bunch of ways you can cook trout, like in the oven and on the grill and stuff, but let me know how you guys cook your trout, because I really only cooked it one way, and that's this way, it just depends if it's in the oven or what. Sitting here, you know, cooking up the fish, flicked over, just a dead blackbird chilling in the water, and there's a frog. Look at that little sucker. All the wildlife out here. It's crazy. Flip her over. She's starting to flake real nice and good. Gonna put a little more seasoning on it, but looks like it's gonna turn out pretty good, which is good because I'm I'm hungry. Alright, so we got the trout done. Sauce the bluegills in. Oh, that's steaming. Good God. Yep, oil's hot. That's how you know your oil's hot. When you put it in, it starts boiling like that. Yeah, and especially when it spills out and it feels boiling hot. You yeah. know it's pretty hot. And when you use a plastic fork and it melts. <laughs> but let's try this trout here. Got a nice piece of fish here. All battered up. All battered up. Pretty good. Oh, maybe a little heavy on the seasoning, but That's the way I'd like it. Yeah, it's pretty darn good. All right, got a little piece dry here. Honestly, it's pretty good. Not too heavy on the seasoning, I don't think, but get a bigger piece. Perfect. The trout's like perfectly cooked because it's just nice and flaky falls right off the bone you just stick your fork in pull it up falls right off the bone you get a little piece just munch it and it's it's pretty good but i i like trout so opinions a little biased but i definitely eat this again 
outer all cleaned off. Just fell right off the bone. Don't need that anymore. Right. So I'd say the bluegills are done. We're gonna scoop them out and toss them in the bowl. And we'll taste them. When you guys cook your bluegills and you're out, you know, roughing it, like we are, do you eat the tail like a potato chip? Because I've heard of some people doing that. Kind of wanted to try it, but I don't know. What do you guys do? All right, so to be honest, it doesn't look that good, but. Tastes fine. Tastes like a potato chip. Like air, mainly. But, yeah. Let's try the bluegill. Tastes just like the trout, believe it or not. Like bluegill, too. Yeah, it tastes like bluegill. <laughs> I'd say it's pretty darn good. Alright, season my piece up a little bit. Got some red seasoning on there. And, and a bone. bone. And a bone. <laughs> Right, yeah. Here we go. It's a lot flakier than trout, but the flavor is pretty much the same. I like it. Alright, so we're back at the truck. Got my slushy. It's got his seeds. We're gonna be heading out. Thanks for watching.